Hi, welcome to the Phys Ed Home. We are going to do an activity called Move Up Hockey. This will work on your passing and shooting accuracy in the sport of hockey. Now, the equipment you need, so that I don't have cones. For my starting line, I used a pair of sneakers. I have one here and one here, and it's four feet away from each other. And then, from the sneaker that's on your right side, straight ahead, I have, instead of cones, items I have around the house. So four feet away I have a TV remote, six feet away I have a cup, eight feet away I have a can, and ten feet away I have a sock ball. But you can use any small item as your cone. You're also going to need an empty water bottle as your target. And I'm going to put it at the first target by the remote in the center of the starting line. You're also going to need your hockey puck. So I'm using a sock ball. Again, this is just a pair of socks you roll up into a ball. And your hockey stick. If you don't have a hockey stick, you can use a broom stick as your long handled implement. Again, on how to hold it, what I like to do is grip the middle by pretending I'm shaking hands with it and then my thumbs are down, and then putting my hand on top with my thumbs down and the brush part on the ground. If you feel comfortable like this, great. If not, you can always switch it. Put your hand in the middle, thumbs down, hand on top, thumbs down. Totally up to you. Now, here's how you play. You start with the sock ball in the center of the starting line, and you're going to pass or shoot the sock ball to try to hit the water bottle. Okay, when you follow through, don't go too high. At most, go up about your waist, okay? So again, I'm gonna aim for the target. Boom, I knocked it down. I then pick up the water bottle and I move it up to the next target, which is the cup. I dribble my hockey puck back, my sock ball, I get into position and I shoot again, okay? If you miss, you have to retrieve it, dribble it all the way back, and shoot again. If you take a shot and you hit it and knock it over, you get to pick it up and move it on to the next one, which is the can. Dribble back using your broomstick or hockey stick. If you shoot and you miss, again you retrieve it back. But let's say you shoot from here, you shoot, it slides, it slides, it knocks it down, great. You get to move it on to the final distance, and then you shoot again, you shoot again. Let's pretend, let's pretend you were able to hit it. You knocked it down at the final target. You have to take the ball, dribble it all the way back to be complete and finish the challenge. So you're gonna shoot at four, different distances, and you have one minute. Let's see how Coach Gilardi does. The game begins in three, two, one. Yes. Come on, come on. That is not, not as easy as it looks. It takes a lot of, a lot of practice. So good luck. If you want to make that a little easier, you can always take items away and have less distances. Maybe two or three. If you want to make it a little harder, you can always make it a little further away or add more distances. All right? Did it in the nick of time but try to get your best personal time. Thank you for visiting The Zone, the 
fizeram. 